Hi, I'm Paul Tibbet, uh, executive producer of SpongeBob SquarePants. I am Aaron Springer, the... what was I on this one? Storyboard artist. Storyboard. Writer, director. Man. And this is uh, Inmates of Summer. It's, uh, we see SpongeBob has overpacked for Boy Scout camp. SpongeBob! Actually, in his mind, he probably underpacked, right? Probably. He did forget one thing. His best friend, Patrick. SpongeBob! You forgot to tell me you were leaving! <laughs> Usually it takes weeks for their goodbyes, doesn't it? Yeah. They've... It's a whole event. It has to be scheduled and planned. So while they're uh, having their tearful goodbye... All the campers leave without them. That's right. right. They get That's left behind. A... That's... That'll teach him to cry. <laughs> and somehow the Boy Scouts and the prison inmates all leave from the same dock. It's part of the magic of Bikini Bottom. I'll see you later, bud. Patrick, that's it! You can come with me to summer camp! I, I think that's a result of the uh, economic summer. crisis <laughs> that, that could the be. world's <laughs> currently <laughs> experiencing. Stim- yeah. It's quite a stimulus. Uh, this is uh, the drill sergeant, or the, the... I don't know what you call him in prison. Thanks! No, no, he's the, definitely not a porter, but that's um, the voices. L. Lee Ermy. R. Lee Ermy. R. Lee Ermy. Oh, what? I'm sorry. He's, He's so enraged he has the power to singe holes yeah. through coffins <laughs> using his pupils. Boy, that yeah. looked like a boy. Anger vision. Yeah. <laughs> SpongeBob has no idea he's going to prison. Otherwise, I we suppose wouldn't. that prison would be. Loosely based on the actual prison known as Alcatraz. Oh, uh, yes, it? that's been Zonor. closed for many years. Yeah. Infernal Island. Inescapable. What in the seven seas just assaulted my eardrums? Could that have been an unrequested sound off? Well, it must Maybe he recognizes his voice. He's been in uh, a lot of movies, and I think he even had his own show on TV, didn't he? Yeah. 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 We can't say the name of it, though. Yeah. Otherwise, we get in trouble. But we can say. Ooh. <laughs> you could say that. Yeah. There's other things. So, um. a couple of rabble rousers. What's your name, son? SpongeBob SquarePants. And are you a rabble rouser? Rabble. Rabble. What is rabble? Because you sure look similar to rubble. And it's too soon after breakfast for me to want to. Or rabble. No, that's what the. Uh, Barney, uh, I can't say yeah, his name. Yeah. <laughs> so he's cleverly constructed these tortures for his uh, inmates. Yeah. Including. Yeah. Making them eat. Forcing them to eat tires. Yeah. I know the perfect place for you. They seem to enjoy it, though. Digest that meat. <laughs> a couple days in the hole, never hurt anybody. <laughs> Except that guy behind SpongeBob. Well, he's feeling no pain. Yeah. I had no idea they had a hot tub. They think they're. They still think they're at a a spa, a day spa. So I guess that means Chum is hot. Can be. Leave it out too long. Gets a little warm. And see what's waiting for you next time you fell up the same way these two did. Uh, so he uses them as an example. It was quite an enjoyable <laughs> show. Backfires. Right. It doesn't really show any anything because they seem to enjoy everything, no matter what. Cut your traps, all of you, because of that little outburst. I am going. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that tangent. So oh. Wrenchingly boring and physically exhausted <laughs> that right. it is guaranteed to render your soul broken beyond repair. Much <laughs> like storyboarding. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so kids don't have outbursts because it leads to this. Hard labor. Hard labor. 
challenging by the fact that we're keep all your the feelings place. inside. That's right, locked up. Um, as if they were in jail. Yeah. Feelings jail. <laughs> Oh, uh, boy. If only we could think of some sort of group activity that we could all do together. Oh, so they want to, they, here they want to spice up, they're talking about spicing up the yeah. other campers' uh, experience. Yeah, they think they're, they still think they're at camp. Yeah. They don't know they're in prison. So, Spongebob sets out to uh, write a play. Uh, yep, via brief montage that's true but i like how he sticks one piece i, I do like that under scene. the door so chris ricardi was the other uh, writer and storyboard artist on this episode yes he would he couldn't be here today but uh yeah you and chris worked together several times right i mean you've worked not just on SpongeBob, but uh, on other a few other projects. Other we've projects. Together, yeah. huh? You guys well, met. Always enjoyable. Yeah, he's a, he's a great artist. Pathetic, meaningless, ridiculous production. You know why? <laughs> he strikes a fine figure. Yeah, as well. I like the cut of his jib. your pathetic lives. So get to it. And I better be truly entertained. So now they have to put on a play for their very existence. Kids wasting his time. Hold on. They just don't get it, do they? You thinking what I'm thinking? Uh, it's a boat, you simpleton. What do boats do? Uh, make smoke. That guy's got a real classic feel to him. Yeah. Sort of like a, uh... Island with all of us on board. Oh, I can't mention that. <laughs> Do you remember the the voice actor that did that guy? Hey, yeah, that's Bill Fogerbucky. Oh, that's Bill. Yeah. Okay. Actually, also the voice of Patrick. So it's a packed house. Babe. <laughs> Jibsmen, what forces blow the merry winds of Galilee? Hmm. And so starts the musical. The song was written by Chris Riccardi, and I believe Eben Schletter composed the music. Nice detail with the slider on the synthesizer. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Patrick's uh, multi talented. Who knew? That's the way it ought to be together. Just you and you and you and you and, and me. Together. These guys did pretty good for uh, not rehearsing at all. <laughs> staring directly at this nose dripping. Not, yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? We're breaking out of here. That's what. That's Tough guys cry too. Oh, and thanks for the convincing stagecraft. So convincing. Encore, encore. <laughs> the wardens like it. Well, you know, that's really all that mattered. What the? What the? That's become the new catchphrase of the SpongeBob SquarePants show. It's all part of the yeah, was, part of the plan. That was written in. That's the third act. To imagine a punishment appropriate for what has happened here tonight. How many times have you heard that before? The, 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 the complete disregard for the story tradition of musical theater. So, starting this very moment, every one of you sub protozoas will be sentenced to. Hi. Hello! You! What in the name of. Here comes the camp council. Yeah, it looks like they finally figured out that someone was missing. For Neptune's sake, man, speak to King's English. I. 
I'm Camp Counselor Kraus from Sunfun Island. You're who? Kraus? Is that me? Yeah. When discovered one of my son was missing, I came to take him back with me. A SpongeBob uh, SquarePants? Enough! So tell me, Counselor, just what do they do on your sunny, funny island? Well, we uh make macaroni art. He can. And we sing campfire songs. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, he that's an actual it. activity, yeah. a camp activity, help and support. Yeah. Can be done around the campfire. It needs to be taught. It's not something everyone can do naturally. You can actually score it. <laughs> Earn prizes. <laughs> yeah, there's a badge. Help and support badge. So pipe cleaners, macaroni, glue. Uh-oh. I like the other island better. Uh, none of which are preferable 